for a treat. Today we're getting into James Moore versus Twinkie Clark in a vocal battle. Who gonna win? Let's go! Don't sleep on Twinkie! <laughs> we gonna find out. Let's go. Let's get it. What I love about this is like, she did the same amount of notes. I don't know if, I don't know if I can do that one. I don't, like I love that. Twinkie's ear, she is so impeccable. Like he said, and she's like, I don't know if, I don't know if I can do that one. Like she sang, she really sang that the same style and it's a moment of her own flair, but like her ear, her perfect pitch. See, Twinkie, see. I don't know if, I don't know if I can do all that one. Like what? Crazy. <laughs> Because James is a singing man, Twinkie is a singing woman. But together, <laughs> crazy. But like that last lick that she did, that last run, like that's, you can hear where Karen gets it from. What does Karen do? That same thing. She does that, but Karen will do it faster, quicker, and more. She'll make it more complicated. But like you could hear like the similar tone and the similar style, like Twinkie taking that high note and hitting that high note and doing that descending run. hear it and then you can see that we always see Karen do it like that's one of Karen's favorite things to do but who did she get that from Twinkie right there is proof oh! Oh! 
Twinkie gave her that or that she took something and that she kind of like honed it, sharpened it, did her own thing. But Twinkie, that's why they call Twinkie the Clark sister. You can literally hear that, right? Because that was craziness in itself. Twinkie's run so musical, so melodic. And the, the tone, the timbre of her voice is so beautiful. It's so rich. And just the growl. And I always appreciate like how in certain moments, like Twinkie's voice, it has so much nuance and depth to it. Like when she's singing normally like that, you know, like it's so, it's like, it's just rich and it's just resonant. And then if she wants to yell or holler, it has like a little bit of, 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 of grit in there. Like there was like a natural like squall in her voice or a little bit of grit to her sound that is not as common and I love that like her voice can like stretch in that way and like kind of come back like that too it's like really really dope to me because I'm just like you know it's like oh, it's like it sounds like that but then it's like, oh, it's like what is that it's like oh it's like it's crazy like the dimension the dimensions and the dynamics that Twinkie has in her voice alone it's really really cool and I always appreciate that and like for James versus Twinkies like okay Twinkie you win because who is going to be Twinkie besides Karen but it's because Karen has sopped up all the goodness of the, her sisters in addition to her own talent, style, skill, and gifting, which is bananas and insane. That's why she's Michael Jackson in the family. But I just love this one of my favorite vocal battles just to watch. And I would just try to emulate it because it's so good and so rich. Like, did you hear that? James did a thing. Twinkie did a thing. Twinkie did a thing. James did a thing. That one time she didn't want to play with it, but she could have. Yeah. But it's so cool to see, like, Twinkie was amazing. Twinkie is amazing, and she's so iconic. And that is one of the reasons why I love me some Twinkie Clark. Sing, Twinkie! Huh? So good to my soul. But like I say, if you have another video me to react to, come below, get to it as soon as I can. As I always say, don't get bitter because life does get better. With Jesus, life gets better. He was there all the time. No matter what you were thinking, no matter what you were feeling, the Lord was there. The Lord was there. He was <laughs> waiting to stand in line. He was waiting to intercede. He was waiting to intervene. And God probably intervened in ways that you did not see. So I just pray that God will give you eyes to see how he was there for you. And no matter what your situation was, no matter your circumstance, no matter if you feel like God neglected you or had forsaken you, I pray that the Lord will give you eyes to see things differently from his lens and from his vantage point rather than your own and the narrative of fear trauma and the life in jesus name i just release that over you amen because he was there all the time i love when james sings that and i love when twinkies sing it back there's nothing like a call and response with a twinkie clark